Now, this game has been pretty interesting so far. But without further ado, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to another Mafia Definitive Edition. Thank you guys for all the love and all the support on the previews. I do appreciate it. This year, I do plan to do some other stuff and diversify my channel. Even though they're not getting as many views as I thought they would, I don't even understand how I have 20 something K subs and I only get a thousand views on some of these videos. But it is what it is. Um, we're gonna just keep grinding, we're gonna just keep doing what we need to do and um, put ourselves up there. But without further ado, let's hop into this gameplay. We're gonna continue with the story on Mafia and let's see how this works, y'all. Now, if you guys want, you can go ahead and follow me on my other socials. It's going to be Twitter and uh, and Instagram. You guys can go ahead and follow me on there. And um, I think it will be very, very interesting for you guys to go ahead and do that. Um, thank you guys again for all the love and all the support. But uh, let's continue here. Someone spun your tail, pal. You got an informant right there that says Merle made a mint every time crackers went to the mat. That's true, too. And still... Morello left that poor sap dead in the street. Head all caved in. I don't square. Well, maybe the Don knew Joey's career was on the downhill. Or maybe he was trying to scare some other guy into paying up. Who knows? Don Celieri chalked it up to Morello not being able to think straight when he was mad. You, uh... Huh? Have any more run-ins with Morello's crew back then? Not at first. For a couple of years after I joined up, things were quiet. We got into a few dust-ups with guys trying to muscle in, but elsewise it was just the usual routine. We are running booze, offering protection, me and the boys doing rounds to collect small time. But I ain't gonna lie. Most days, we was also having a bit of fun. Right, he graduates from now. the junkers to gal jobs, and I start placing a few bets on him here and there. Next thing I know, I've made all my money back and more. Hey, uh, Sam says he's the guy to beat. He was. We ran all the competition out of town. But now Ralph says there's a hotshot European entering the race. Y'all missed the first part because I was on a phone call. A I didn't like to skip it. How much do we stand to lose? A truckload. It's crazy. But not just our outfit. A lot of guys from the neighborhood come to me for financial advice. They've all put money down on this kid. It'll be like Black Thursday around here if he loses. Well, for everyone except Morello. Oh, you think he's from the European? Oh, I'm certain of it. You want something to happen to the driver? Can't find them. Morello's got him holed up somewhere safe. Besides, if he drops out or disappears now, none of our wagers will stand. Everyone will cry foul, say the race is fixed. Hmm. What about his car? That's the ticket, Tommy. Ralph knows a guard at the track. You go down there tonight, you boost the European's car, bring it to one of our mechanics and make a few adjustments, you bring the car back. Should be no problem, boss. Sarah, you gotta go and steal the car then? Here? I'm assuming. As as you're ready. Sure thing. Yeah. Gotta talk to Ralph. Look at this half portion. Where were you last night? I was with you. That's a five, six. Hey, Okay. Let's talk to Ralphie. Hey, Titi Tommy. Big day coming up, right? right? You, you, you seen the race before? Uh, kind of hard to miss. Celieri isn't going to let Morello break his winning streak, huh? No, no, sir. Got to send him a message. So, tonight, we will borrow his guy's motor from the track. My friend Bobby is a guard. For a little dough, he'll show you where it is. Then look someplace else while you t -t -t turn the key. I like Bobby already. Sh sure. Then in there is this other guy, Lolo Lucas Bertone. You take the car to him down under the Ju Ju Giuliano Bridge. He'll, you know, tune it a little. Make the race tomorrow more, more, more interesting. And then I take the car straight back and Bobby can stop looking someplace else. But, but you gotta be quick. But, but Bobby comes off shift at 1.30 and then and, and, and the next guy... He's an ass. Okay. Oh, hey, hey. If so you I gotta need be somewhere quick. to keep your mama motor safe, where no one can take them, feel free to use the garage. Carlo finally got around to clearing it out. Thanks. Good to know. Okay. So I do not have any other cars. Oh, shoot. 
Let's drive a bike then. I think my field of view is way too high. Display. Let's turn this back down. <coughs> I think 65 is good. There we go. Bikes were probably a lot better in these times than, than cars. So this bike looks. Oh my god. Bruh. Damn, look at that drip, bro. Crazy. That's the popo. -po. That's the police. Alright, let's go down to the track, see if we can get whatever we need to get. The car that we need to get and move from there. Bobby. Yep. We can take my car through to the garage. It's a ways off. Any friend of Ralphie's a friend of mine. If you got the money, mm -hmm. sure. Just let anybody drive your car? That's crazy. I never let anybody drive my car. <sighs> Tomorrow morning they start coming. Whole city. They smuggle in hooch. I definitely don't let anybody drive my car, bro. I hate it. Ah, come on. Name a better place to pick up a dame than this place this weekend. Don't get me started. <sighs> Things I've seen. Mm, interesting. We send one guy to protect whatever car this is. Okay, this is it. One guy to protect this car. That's crazy. No wonder they got their stuff boosted, bro. I would just send one guy. Here she is. 1929 Carazella C Series. Best in class. It's a shame you gotta wreck it. If they see this down the road, cops are gonna ask questions. When they catch up, sure. Try to keep it one piece too, huh? So, I gotta be back from Berton by 1.30 before mm -hmm. the next guy shift. Yeah, he's an ass. I heard. All right, can I can I get into the car? Do I have to be on this side? Oh, this thing is way faster. I'm going to hit that. Oh my gosh. This thing is pretty fast, considering the cars that are around at this time. And it's not staying very straight. It's definitely not staying very straight. I'm trying to keep it straight. It's just not being very straight. Maybe I should just use my controller. Oh. My bad. My bad. My bad, man. My bad. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, I'm actually going 100 miles an hour. Nice. Can probably hit 120 the way this is going. Oh, look at that drift, bro. Crazy. Let's 
thing is pretty fast. Yeah. Considering like some of the cars around here, yeah, it's, it's, it moves a little bit. Do your little right tweaks. Do your tweaks or whatever, Tell and then we go. Lucas Bertoni. Oh, ain't she a thing of beauty? We don't have much time. Why would hey, they got I'm the tire on the worker. side? Sit tight. Why they got that thing on the side? The tire would it not like cause some, you. some weight issues? There's just so Thanks, much Lucas. smoking around these times. I gotta get back before anyone catches on. Go easy with her. She's gonna misbehave. Hey, tell Mr. Salieri I'm always available for this kind of work. I do stuff for a lot of people, but I always know where I stand with you guys. Hot cars, getaways, anything for the right price. Let's just hope Salieri's guy wins tomorrow. For all our sakes. Okay. All right. Drive careful. Bro said the car's gonna miss me here. Oh shoot, I'm already going the wrong way. Move. Damn, he really wrecked the car, bro. This thing is not going anywhere. It's struggling, bro. The car is struggling right now, bro. Damn. Let's hope I can make it. Cause right now, bro, this thing is struggling. On my way, bro. On my way. Oh, that's a wall. Don't want to hit that. Yeah, it's moving left to right. It's not being able to stay straight. Somebody's gonna gonna wreck tomorrow for sure. Whoever drives this car is gonna be wrecked tomorrow. Move! Why are you? Why are you stopping in the middle of an intersection, you idiot, bro? Damn taxi drivers, bro. Like right there. Why are you? Why are you doing that, bro? Look left and right before you come over this middle of the road. I want some foolishness, bro. Yeah, this car is aft, bro. This car ain't doing nothing tomorrow. Tomorrow in the game. Oh, you're back. There Thank you go. Christ. Good to go. Drives like a jalopy. Okay, let's get out of can't here. Can't tell. Big day tomorrow. I can tell this thing drives pretty bad. Crazy. So Sam walks here. out of the bathroom, and I'm praying he's 
got a piece on him, because I'm not sure the bartender's gonna hand over what he owes. And his two sons, they're inching closer. I can hear them cracking their knuckles. They're both seven feet tall, built like brick shit houses. What were you carrying? My dick. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. This crazy bastard, he waltzes out of the bathroom to start pissing all over the joint. Really? <laughs> what, he didn't call the cops? Nah. Sometimes you just gotta make them think you're crazy. <laughs> Tom, you got the moment. Oh. Sure, Frank. You've got a bit of a situation. Is the boss okay? Oh, yeah. It's nothing like that. Mm. Mikey Dunn, our driver. Some of Morello's guys roughed him up pretty good last night. Broke his arm, broke his jaw. Send him to the hospital. Jesus. Yeah, tough a locker for Mikey. Anyway, you're going to race for him. Wait, what? Wait, what? Frank, Tom, it's a half hour before the starting gun goes off, so this is not a discussion. The Don wants to win, but more importantly, he wants Morello to lose. And you are our best wheelman. Otherwise, Can't I'll be talking right to someone else. Yeah. Okay, Frank. Good. Hmm. Rafi has the car gassed and ready. Get to the track right away. Interesting. From Europe, we got the hotshot favorite, Martin Lichtenberg, taking some time out of the International Series to compete with us today. Got some news from the grid here. Lost Heaven local favorite Mikey Dunn is out. Replacing him is uh, Tommy Angelo. Well, I'm sure you'll all join me in wishing him good luck. Well, I guess so. They're lined up on the grid. They're ready to start. Now we got our Oh, my control has to be. But there are some worried faces from the mechanics in the pit lane. Yeah, his thing is destroyed. A Let's hope for a safe race today. Safe? Bro, why am I racing in a mafia game? Jesus! Move out of my way! And of course they would do that. Why, why are the cars driving so slow? It's not, that's not how they were when I was... When I was driving it on the street. Oh, it's a tight pack as they fight for first. Jesus! Bro, what are you I doing? I hope they can walk away. Out of my way. McKenna oh, loses first to Garcia. Garcia struggles on the bend. This could go anywhere. Jesus! Oh. Ugh. Aggressive driving from Angelo. This is crazy. No longer a contender. The front three is wrestling for position. Jesus. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Move out of my way. Wrong with you. Exit really has blown this race out wide. All right, let's keep going. I'm gonna catch these two. Wait, what was that? What was that? What? What? Bruh. I'm gonna catch back up. You kidding me? Asshole! Some rough racing. Bro, hold some traction in the corner. Let's go, man. Some Punch drivers it. really starting to stretch out ahead now. You asshole! I ain't doing that, man. What's wrong with you? Ah, crap! Tommy Angelo takes the lead. Damn. The final podium places, or is it someone else's time to shine? Did somebody just crash? That's crazy. Ah, shoot! I just right. Tommy 
Taylor, Anderson, Angelo, all still in the mix with time still left to go. Nobody in the mix. I'm just way ahead. Well, not really way ahead, but I'm ahead. Look at this. Damn. Newcomer Tommy Angelo is still out in front. Why are you on me like that, buddy? Get off my neck. The leading drivers are on the final lap. Not long till it's all over, folks. Gotta pump the brakes. Don't try not to break in the in the corner. Dump the speed before I get into the corner. And just let it glide through the corner. I can keep it pushing with this one. Who needs Mikey Dunn? This guy is a fine replacement. I right, go here. Dump my speed. Oh, almost hit that. And I accelerate through the corner. There we go. Angelo is still out in front. Can he hold on? I keep messing up on that corner right there. I keep messing up on that corner. Tommy Angelo's in first, but right, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Alright. Uh-huh. That's that corner. There ain't no mistakes from Angelo. And I'm out of here. Later, bub. He's catching me. Later, bub. Later, bub. It's a good thumbnail right there. That would be a good thumbnail right there. I hope I got it. Hey, Tommy! There's <laughs> our winner! Hey, Tom. Just want to thank you for stepping in like you did. I had six months rent riding on that race. I'd be homeless now if not for you. I just did what the Don asked, Lucas. Well, you gotta let me find a way to repay you. Stop by my garage when you get a chance. I might have a line on something that'll mm. turn a buck for you. Sure. That'll be interesting. Thanks. I knew you wouldn't let us down, Tom. You made us all a lot of money today. And Morel's gonna be picking up pennies off the sidewalk for weeks. <laughs> hey, what about the European? He's probably wearing cement boots by now, the poor bastard. That's Ooh. crazy. Here. You earned every dollar of this. Take your girl out somewhere. Wait, nice. he got a he got a girl? Thanks, crazy. Boss. <laughs> Tom me a player. You got a girl, right? I don't want you blowing all that on booze and horse. Something, huh? Cheers. Nah, but uh Maybe I'll buy my mom a new coat. <laughs> Good boy. Go get yourself a drink. Interesting. Congratulations, big hero. Nah, I just got luckies off. Well, I had my money on the other guys, so... Drinks are on you. <laughs> oh. oh. She knows she won it. <laughs> there. Now you're ready for the pictures. Thanks. And hey, when you're done celebrating, you might want to go find your buddy, Polly. He's so drunk, he's going to get hit by a parked car. Yeah, okay. I'll get him home safe. She knows she won. She won Tommy, man. She won Tommy, bro. <laughs> Where's Polly at? Hey, Polly! Where you at, my man? Great race, champ. Where's Polly? Come on, Polly. Where you at, buddy? Where did Polly go? Great race, champ. Hey, last time I saw you drive like that, Tom, I had a gun to your head. You saying there wasn't one today? <laughs> That's crazy. When our side of town is drowning in dough. That means you're safe. Hey, you seen Polly? Guy soused. Came through walking sideways. Yeah, I heard. We gotta go look for Polly. Is that him right there? No, it's not. 
Sorry guys for no music, but I don't know if it's I don't know if it's uh Right, um, that thing right there, uh, the, the music, I can't have music because, you know, otherwise it'll, uh, it'll be weird. Oh, thank Christ you're here. If your friend keeps this up, the other guy's gonna send the cops over. Yeah, I think Polly's big day at the track's over. Oh, there he is. What's going on, Polly, man? Is that man with that, that weird voice? High voice. What does the bird say? I don't know, but the security guy back there says you gotta go home. That's an asshole. You should show some respect. Well, that's true, but I'm saying you gotta go home too before you resurface the pit lane. Well, okay then. I guess. <laughs> Let's go, Jim. Alcohol. It's crazy. Alcohol does those things to people. Come on, Polly. You're too drunk, bro. You're too drunk, Polly. Let's go. We're gonna take Polly home. Cause Polly's you did mad. did real now. good today, Tommy, with the the driving. I was right. I was right when I found you. You know what I said? What, what did, did you, you say, say? Polly? I said, this guy can drive, Don Salieri. This is a guy who can drive. Mm. And here we are. Here we are. And here we go. Right here. And here where we are. We you put me to shame, Tom. Mm -hmm. Look at you. Now you're even a some kind of race car driver. We all got our... You're doing real good since you joined the family, but you know you got it easy, right? <laughs> Me and Sam, we keep the real stuff from you. That right, huh? You don't know what it's like. You get the call to see the Don and your mind's racing. Then some bad shit, Tom. We're all yeah. in this together. I do what the Don asks when he asks it. Just like you. You're like just me, like you can't you. just shut it down. Blank it out like Sam does. Mm. Go home to whoever the hell he goes home to. Bali, you're drunk. You're gonna have to clam up for your own sakes. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Yeah, you're drunk, buddy. Let's go take him home. Um, I wanna go with the lady. Uh, I'm not helping you with that today. Take me to the ladies. Take me to the blue tropics. I don't know. I ought to take you home. The bridge. Take the bridge over to the island. Take me to the ladies. Take me to those sweet patooties. Bro. Bro. Uh, home? Bro, me home. Bro, you drunk, bro. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe that's. Yeah. A good idea. It is a yeah. good idea. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, Paul. Okay, I'm gonna. Sweet dreams, tough guy. Uh, I'm gonna. Yeah. Is he gonna, I don't feel so good. I think he's about to vomit. I, I think he was about to vomit, bro. <laughs> that was crazy. Oh, now we got. Now we got. What? Got the girl now. Anyways. That's going to be it for today's video. Thank you guys for all the love and all the support on these videos. I do appreciate it. Hope you guys enjoyed that. I know it was a shorter episode, but I'm going to keep trying to do these. But uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Have a great day. Have a great week. Peace, everybody.